Okay, so sometimes you guys have seen in the past maybe a guy in a triangle situation, he locks it the other way. That's okay to do. Um, I do that sometimes. I'm going to take you through some techniques. But uh, the big thing I'm going to cover right now is when you do that reverse figure four, I'm going to show you how I recommend doing it. And then I would recommend you almost majority of the time attack the arm attacks and like the Kimura and all the stuff I, I just covered. All right. So when we're here, let's say I'm, I'm in this situation, a lot of times there'll be arm on the mat because if he's arm in the center, he should be able to adjust. Okay. And all that. If it's here and I, I just feel like I can't get it, you pull, you know, you want to get the head down. Okay. And while I'm having a head down, instead of being taking this one and looking for the, the submission, when I pull the head down, I'm going to go here. The opposite. Now I'm going to pinch the opposite, just like I did for the normal triangle. See how I do that leg flare? That leg flare? Now, stay tight and holding. I don't want this hand fighting me. I'm going to now lock and here. Now you can try to squeeze here and granted he tap, but keep in mind, I'm not having a hamstring in the side of the neck. I'm using the side of my thigh. So it's not really optimal. Can I tap him out? Maybe, maybe I can't. Okay. But I definitely wouldn't be here trying to pull the head down. I don't think you're going to get much gold there. If you're gonna try to finish this, okay, so if I'm here, arms off to the side, okay, I wanna crunch up, hopefully my body's not gonna hide too much of this. Okay, I'm crunching up, pull that head down, lock, flare, bring that nice and high, hug my knee, and now squeeze and flex, and try to get that tap, okay? If you don't, look, I'm in a good spot, look at this elbow, boom, I start attacking shoulder, arm locks, hitting Kimuras, all that, this, you okay? Yep. That, that reverse lock there is great for that kind of stuff. You don't need it, like I showed you just previously, but if you're in a situation, you're like, okay, this guy's opened me up or whatever the case is, this triangle is gonna, it's not gonna be there. By switching to that reverse, you now can adjust and attack that arm a little easier. You know, it's not less torquing on your body and you can go two on one and start submitting that arm. Um, if you're gonna try to finish that reverse, hugging the knees is how I would do it. It's how I would do it. Other words, you're gonna have to add a modification, which we'll get to.